What's up guys and welcome back to my channel. As the season changes, nothing beats having a nice warm bowl of soup on a cold autumn day. Today I'll be showing you how to make my spicy pumpkin soup. This recipe is easy and can be adjusted to your liking. Let's get started. First, you have to cut and clean out your pumpkin. Cut the pumpkin in half and scrape out all the seeds with a spoon. You can save and roast the seeds later if you want. Now, to roast, you'll want to cut your pumpkin to your desired size. I cut them into smaller pieces so it would cook a bit faster. Start by placing your pumpkins skin side up on a baking tray. If you decide to leave them in larger pieces, poke some holes with a fork or a knife. Then, drizzle some extra virgin olive oil. Using a brush, make sure each piece of pumpkin has olive oil on it. Next, you want to season with salt and pepper. Bake at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for 40 to 50 minutes, or until the pumpkin is tender. I roasted 3 quarters of my pumpkin and medium diced the rest. Now let's work on the base of your soup. Like any delicious soup, you start by adding your oil. Now your chopped garlic. Give it a nice stir. Cook until golden but not burned. Add your onions. Cook until they are almost translucent. Add your green bell peppers and diced pumpkin. Give them a nice stir and let it cook for four to six minutes, stirring every so often so it won't burn. Add the Thai chilies, ginger, and the chili powder. If you don't want this to be too spicy, use only half the amount of Thai chilies and half the amount of chili powder. Mix until everything is combined. Add your water or vegetable stock and bring to a boil. Give it a nice stir to mix it all together. You want to boil until your pumpkin is tender. Once you can break apart the pumpkin with a fork, turn off the heat. Add half of the roasted pumpkin, leaving the other half for garnish. You can remove the skin if you like, but I left mine on for extra flavor. Use an immersion blender to blend the soup. When most of the ingredients are blended up, add the almond milk. This can be replaced with coconut milk or heavy cream. Give it a nice stir to mix it all together. Throw in the butter and stir until the butter is all melted. Now you want to taste the soup and season with salt and freshly ground pepper to taste. All that's left is to plate and garnish. Start by pouring some soup into your bowl. Slice some of the roasted pumpkin and put some on top. Add some sliced scallions. Lastly, sprinkle some cinnamon on top. And that's it. Grab a spoon and dig in. Enjoy! Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button or you can share it with your friends. Feel free to comment or subscribe if you haven't already. I am Bon Appetit and I'll see you in the next one.